All right, we are stripping Dio, who is my hairy puppy. I've already stripped his thigh and a part of his uh, side. So I wanted you to see the difference. Now he's really fighting me. He does not want to be stripped anymore. Um, so I'm going to give him a break in a minute. But um, the way you want to strip is that you can see how his hair, and he's actually, he was outside wet, um, which will help you with stripping. Um, you can see much better how I'll grab the longer fur, look for the bottom of the hair, and then pull. I'll pull up a bit, and then pull, pull, and pull. Sometimes if you overstrip them, and you see these spots, don't worry about it. It's gonna go back, it's gonna grow back. So this is actually the hand stripping. So when groomers tell you that they hand strip a dog, um, and they use a stripping knife that is not hand stripping. Um, get just a rubber glove and it takes time, much longer, but uh, the coat is gonna come back much nicer, darker and more harsh, as which is what you want in a wire hair grishla. I am going to show you how to strip a medium harsh wire haired Vigla coat. Uh, this is the unstripped coat. I have not stripped her for five months. Um, I've already started stripping her. So this is gonna be the before and then the after. And what I do with her as well, just like with my um, longer um, wire haired Vigla, longer haired wire haired Vigla, I will brush the hair up look for the bottom of the blonde hair and then pull that out and down out and in that down movement you want to make sure that you never rip the hair up you always want to pull it out and down um, the best grooming equipment you'll have is a rubber glove um, if they have a wet coat that's will that will help you it will stick to your glove much better um, on sensitive areas such as her ear I like to use this Greyhound uh, stripping knife this is very good for the details especially down on the edge it takes out the hair very nicely and on her feet if I don't use the detailed one then I like to use a little bigger stripping knife and again same thing it's I'm always stripping down 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 you don't want to pull it up because that's how you break the the fur you want to pull it down but to get the best coat you just want to use a rubber glove brush the hair up grab it at the bottom and then pull it out and her coat is going to be perfect in about six weeks and then when you are trying to maintain the shorter coat then again use this grab onto it and kind of just brush working hard on her coat because we got some shows coming up. The same thing. And then my favorite tool is a rubber glove. Especially if she's wet, you're gonna get a good hold off of it. Same thing, you kind of brush your hand back. Look for the, all the blondes. Again, she doesn't have much because I've been, I've been stripping her all the time. But just look for the blonde and then pull those out. Do that when you're watching TV or just chilling with her. 